understanding the phrase, check for doneness. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into a common culinary phrase in the English language, check for doneness. This phrase might sound a bit technical, but it's actually quite simple and widely used in cooking contexts. Let's explore what it means and how you can use it effectively. Check for doneness is a phrase commonly used in cooking. It means examining food to determine if it has been cooked to the desired level. The word doneness refers to the degree to which food, especially meat, is cooked. The key components of this phrase are check to examine or look at something carefully for used here to indicate the purpose of the check doneness the state of being cooked to the desired level this phrase is often used in recipes cooking shows or when preparing meals for example check the cake for doneness by inserting a toothpick into the center if it comes out clean it's ready to ensure your steak is cooked perfectly check for doneness with a meat thermometer Understanding this phrase is important because it's about safety and preference in cooking. Undercooked food can be unsafe, while overcooked food may lose its flavor and texture. While, check for doneness is the most common phrase, there are variations. These include, test for doneness, often used interchangeably with, check for doneness, gauge the doneness, a more technical term, usually used by professional chefs. Each variation essentially means the same thing but might appear in different contexts. When you hear or read, check for doneness, remember these tips. Use appropriate tools, like a thermometer for meat or a toothpick for baked goods. Know the desired outcome. Different foods have different indicators of being properly cooked. Safety first, always ensure food is cooked to the recommended temperature to avoid health risks. Check for doneness is a simple yet essential concept in cooking, emphasizing the importance of cooking food to the right level. Now that you understand this phrase, you're one step closer to mastering culinary terms in English. Happy cooking and language learning!